This video is an excerpt from The Passive Income Show, presented live every week. To learn more about The Passive Income Show, just go to the description box below this video. All right, well, one of the questions that comes up here is the Chad. Is this Chad Newman? This might be the gentleman I'm yeah. talking about. <laughs> okay. Uh, the question is, what are your best tips for the ratio of developing and improving courses and then marketing them? Um, um, that's a good, that's a really good question and something I've, you know, struggled with and learned about over my three years of being on Udemy now. And to be honest, I've spent most of my time creating, developing and creating courses lately. I've done a lot of work to improve my current courses. And I mean, I think it's good to look back at your courses that are over a year old, especially, and update them. Um, I know I look back at some of my courses and the intro videos aren't good. The way that the course is structured isn't as good as it could, it could be. And so just before, for example, before Black Friday sales, I went through my three best-selling courses and I made sure that the sections were correct. I added intros to each section. That's something that Udemy encourages you do for each section, have a little intro video that introduces what you'll be talking about for that section of content. And then I updated some of the course thumbnails and I also updated some of the course promo videos as well. And doing that has really, it seems like it's uh, made a huge difference and I had a good Black Friday sales and those courses can have continued to do well into December. Um, but then there's the whole thing, thing about marketing. And uh, I think a lot of, I think you're either a marketer at heart or you're a creator at heart. And if you're mm -hmm. a creator at heart, you want to be spending time creating your courses, creating things, even if it's not just the course, I'm writing articles, I'm posting YouTube videos. And the good thing is that that stuff is marketing for my courses. I'm creating YouTube tutorials related to my online courses and I link to my online courses and try to promote them through those things. But I do think if I spent more time marketing, probably 50-50 is a good split actually, I would be making even more money from my existing courses uh, because the Udemy audience is 9 million now. I have over 100,000 students in all of my classes, wow. which is amazing. But still, <laughs> that's a very small percentage of that 9 million. And if I did more marketing, I could probably expand that and so I think you got to balance it. I think 50-50 is probably a good split once you have a few courses out there. Thanks for joining me on this video. This video was actually an excerpt from The Passive Income Show, which is a live show that we do every week. You'll get details about The Passive Income Show down below in the description box. You'll also get links to specific courses and discounted links that you can only get here on YouTube. So as always, we would love for you to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel because we're going to be uploading tons of valuable content, valuable video to help you make a passive income online. How? By teaching what you know through your skills, your experience, and your expertise, things that you're interested in like hobbies or interests. We're going to show you how to take that information that you already know and turn it into online courses that will pay you on an ongoing basis, month after month after month, for just teaching what you already know. So I look forward to seeing you on another video, and I look forward especially to seeing you on our live Passive Income Show.